yourself. You really think you're different than you must be kidding. Think you're gonna hit it, but you just don't get it. It's impossible. It's not probable. You're irresponsible. Too many obstacles. You gotta stop it, though. You gotta take it slow. You can't be a pro. No, it's your time no more. Who the fuck are you to tell me what to do? I don't give a damn if you say you disapprove. I'm gonna make my move. I'm gonna make it soon. And I'll do it because it's what I wanna fucking do. Because all these opinions and all these positions, they come in in millions. They block in your vision, but no, you can't listen. Ah. Hello, everyone. This is Crimson. Your favorite fiery red lion. It's been a while, hasn't it? So in my last video that you couldn't hear like any of my uh, voice uh, or even the audio. I did not expect one of my updates to be real uh, silent. And sorry for being gone for so long. I... Okay, just to be honest, I just got in really, really lazy with my upload schedule. And I'm sorry for that. Ah. But I am back and I'm here with a brand new idea. <coughs> and I think you gotta like it. It's What If Deku Found Venom. My god, I don't know why I did that voice. Anyways, uh, we saw the star with uh, how it would normally go. Deku having friends, uh, him being a hero nerd of all things. Uh, with uh, a slight difference. Uh, in the park, uh, when well, I'm in the park, uh, no, yeah, I'm gonna say in the park. This takes place like three days before Isuku uh, and Cosmo split. You know what I mean. Him and his mama with Kasuki's mother, Miski, with a young bucket girl, was having a nice trip at the store. With Isuku by the candy aisle. Having his eyes glowing, uh, like how you expect an adorable young Suku's eyes would glow, saying something really sweet. With uh, Isuku asking Inko, saying, uh, Mom, may I have three bags of that? With uh, Miski look at Isuku surprise. Including Inko and Bagako because, know this, Isuku was n never really had a sweet tooth. Heck, he barely eats sweets at all. So it was a surprise to all three of them uh, he, that Isuku wanted uh, a chocolate bar. But not just any chocolate bar. A chocolate bar that only existed in Legends. A full size, king size chocolate bar. And he said he wanted three bags of it. With uh, Miski say, Medoya, I did not expect you of all people to ask or even want three bags of that. As Inko say, uh, Isuku, uh, are you sure you want three bags of chocolate? As you saw him nod. Uh, sorry, just drinking some water. Inko say, well, uh, okay, dear. Uh, we'll get you three bags of this. As, uh, after that, uh, eh. so, sorry about that, that was not supposed to happen. Anyways, where was I? Oh yes, uh, after that, uh, all three of them went to Isuku's apartment for a little bit of a play date. Uh, ink. And when it was snack time, both Inko and 
Well, uh, Misky herself, a cloning, uh, um, oh yeah, a cloning Bucko, Sai, that's my train of thought there. A cloning Bucko was surprised at the amount of chocolate he said he can eat. With uh, Inko chuckling, saying, well, I guess Isuku has a real sweet tooth for chocolate. With uh, Miski say, well, he's a healthy kid, but it's very surprised he have a sweet tooth for any sweets. So we time scale about three days, uh, well, everything that happened up to his Middle school days were happening in canon. Up to the point where he meets. Oh, nope. Sorry about that. That Thelma was not supposed to be there until the uh, start of the video. It didn't mean to be in the video. I'm sorry. Hey, yeah, was I? Oh, yes. This is the slow feeling. It happens in canon saying. I need that body of yours, kid! <coughs> then, you saw Isuku struggling and all that. Until Isuku fight his fan die, everything was about to went black. Until... He saw a basically black goo went into Isuku's body. And... This black goo forcefully took out the sludge villain straight out of his body. As self, that black goop has a mind of his own. After that, uh, the same interaction with All My Wolf happened. Where Isuku was uh, walking home in shame, and for the first time he felt in years, anger about the two people that basically made fun of him. Until he hears Bucko's voice screaming for help. Then, he saw that same horrific scene with Isuku thinking he couldn't help, but something in his mind is saying, Strength to help. You want to save? Do it, and I'll self help. Then, then the civilians uh, just see Isuku like this, uh, saying, "I will help." Then they just basically ran up to that sludge villain, pulling Isuku out by, well not Isuku, I mean Bucko, yes. He pulled Bucko out with brute strength uh, and was just beating that uh, thing into submission. He looked deep into the sludge villain's eyes, saying, uh, Pancreas, arms, face, so many delicious snacks, but so little time for you. You wanted to hurt a little boy, and you don't want to suffer consequences, huh? With this husband and say, who are you? What are you? You don't remember me? As Venom, yes, this is Venom. Basically, we feel a other half saying, I, that kid. As he recovered his face, saying, Now, what kind of villain would dare to harm a child? Those sort of villains don't deserve a second sense of life. 
How about I see what you taste like? With this last feeling, speak saying, help. Somebody help me, please. I will go to jail. I will help any punishment. So please get this little cake away from me. As easy as Finance just took a thing. <laughs> a second thought. As Venom hears Isuka's voice in his head saying, Wait, don't. I want to be a hero more than anyone. But please, do not do this. Don't try this. Just let him go and the heroes will take care of him. With uh, Venom saying, Okay, kid. As he dropped the... Zvaz Venom, then... Uh, he went back to his, by uh, him. All Might was the one who saw all this and... Let's just say, he was shaking his boots worse than... He was starting to stream with Gran Torino. But he did get the sus feeling. When he, they were praising Bakugo, they were scolding Isuku, where Venom sus came out of Isuku's back, roaring, saying, You are overgrown. Venta is a never get the egotistical apes. As he, as one of the heroes was some guy say power roller. No, no, we, uh, uh, Mount Lady, yeah, Mount Lady was asked, Kid, is this your quirk? As Isuku was thinking, they got to think of something good. Uh, as Isuku saying, uh, yes, uh, uh, this is Venom. He's. He's a recent de development of my quirk. I'm a light bloomer. As uh, one of them say, huh, must be a sentient one. Where Venom say, I'm sentient, alright? And I also know that you, none of you, are considered even real heroes. None of you will be considered a low level cop. With one of them say, what gives you the right to, with Venom interrupting them saying, I got the right because me and Isuku here was the ones who saved that explosive nightmare. While you were standing around with your tails between your legs like a bunch of little brats. You praised a boy who was being controlled. And yet you dare to scold somebody who was basically bullying his whole life. Uh, nearly committed suicide because of that blind head. And he needed help from the same person he looked down upon. And you call yourself heroes if you didn't save somebody because you didn't have to write correct? They all wanted to say something, but they didn't. Even the civilians was too scared to say anything, and was too afraid to even look at that quirk. Where for Isuka said, uh, Venom, I think that's enough. We have to get home. Where for Venom say, Okay, Isuku. Where for Isuka say, it's my saying, I don't even know how he know my name, and I don't even know what's happening. Where Phantom got the hero saying, I just says you get your crap together. Otherwise, I won't be so gentle next time. Where for that happening, Isuka was walking home, but with the stress going on, he took out his favorite chocolate bar and started eating. With they calm him down, with Venom coming out saying, May I have some? With Isuka jumping saying, Oh jeez! Oh, I forgot you were there. As Isuka say, Um, uh, sir. 
Then all of a sudden, they saw Amai again. And that's why I'm gonna leave this what if off. You missed these what ifs? I hope so. But, uh, I will be putting up a poll after I upload this video. You all will decide if Isuka should get one for all or if he shouldn't. Comment down below why he should or should not get one for all. If I see any more of that, then I will choose one or the other. If not, I will make the decision on my own. But if you want part two of this, uh, hit that like button and comment if you want to see part two of What If Deku Found Phenom. This is Crimson, your favorite fiery what ifer, and I'll see you in the next video. It's good to be back. Bye bye now.